Hello, I'm Robin, also known as Far or Fazer or Phaser or however the hell you want to pronounce it really. Um, this is my homemade step sequencer. Um, I will talk to you about it a bit briefly because talking about a hardware is kind of boring and you probably want to see how it works and um, what it works with. Um, in this case I've only tested it with my modular synthesizer which is over here somewhere out of the frame. But it works quite well I guess. Some flaws still but then again it's still a prototype and uh, I'm missing knob caps as well. So but Yeah, let me just go over the features really quickly or as quickly as I can. It's two rows of eight steps, uh, one row of LED which indicates both but you will, you will see how that works later on. Um, and there's one row which sets the gates which are actually just eight steps of gates so um, I've programmed it so the gates will run at the same time as the top row of notes so basically the second row is just sort of a bonus row of steps that you can control a filter cutoff with or anything like um, let's switch it on a couple of there we go it's a beautiful sound there um, yeah there's a load of things here obviously the step outputs here and the gate output over there and uh, there's a little switch here that indicates whether it's using its internal tempo clock or you can switch it and then you can put something like the the uh, high tom output from the TR-606 in the back here which you can't really see but it's, I mean it's I could flip it over but it's such a nice shot so I wouldn't touch it <laughs> um, let's put it back it's not a switch here which indicates um, the sequence to go either forwards, backwards, or completely at random. And this line of knobs right here, this is the start stop button. As you can see in here. Um, this is the tempo knob, and these two knobs um, control the last step of both rows. Now, these are just ordinary rotary knobs, so you kind of have to guess what setting, or what angle I guess um, will set the last step but I sort of indicated it with marker myself so I mean, it's, a, it's a guessing game still but there you go um, yeah let me just show you a little bit there's a little sequence going on on my, uh, or sound sorry, sequence is going here sound is happening over there somewhere like there um, as you can see, you can only see one LED run. Now if I set this, for instance, to about, what would it be like, six steps, looks by it, you can see the second LED just sort of just tracing the other one, which means it's, uh, it's the second row running, so it doesn't indicate a lot, but it kind of looks cool. It's actually designed for. Put it on 
noise. Oh, 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 oh,
watching